Well, I was going to leave until I saw people blubbering. I'll be back. I got to take off. Stop slow down raining. I'll bundle up. I'll be all right. I got. I got to get out of here. Raining or not. Listen. Thank you for having your heart touched. I've got my heart touched. You touch my heart. I don't show it very well. You do. And I spend a lot of time heart touched. And tears of joy as much as any tears of grief. And I got them both look good. Now, when I touch your heart, tears of joy, go mix it with some tears of grief somewhere with a child that's shut in somewhere that no one even paying any attention to where the sour develops. Find out what's helped the child connect some links. Ow! <clears throat> all ages, child. Little kids, all the way up into teenage kids. They're somewhere all over hell. Go find one. Help them connect some links today. Offer some assistance. Sour gets washed away by your sweet presence. It just doesn't breed in their mind. The conception where they, just no one cares. They need them. Don't hit them as often in their mind. When they go to think, i got to go do this can't. Go do that can't. i go to can't, can't, can't. I believe they try every wonderful idea first before they try any of the crap. Go give them some help with the wonderful ideas they're trying before they try the crap. One. Right, and when I touch you, do it. Not on the playground. Not official. Not getting pat on the back. No, the other group that no one's paying attention to. Go help connect the dots. The ones that everyone don't like. The ones that oh, he's sour. Go give him a hand. Go help the sour kids today. They're all over hell. They're not playing sports. They've not been invited. They've been jaded out for one reason or another. Go give them a hand. One. When I touch your heart. Move. They're all around you. You all know who they are? They're all around you. Every neighborhood ought to have a very efficient project for it. <clears throat> child after child. Each one. Each one. Every neighborhood. Break up into small pods and do it. Just like family pods. From ten ancestors. Great, great, great. All the way down. In every pod. You don't have that genetics with you now? Most unfortunate you had it one time. Average probably eight to five. Somewhere from parent all the way up. And the parents were young, mixed with old. Unfortunately, you think that's horrible. Well, you look how the mammals do. And it wasn't anything vulgar about it. And I tell you, it was very well planned. Long before it ever took place. Something you and I understand nothing about. With the breeding process of humans here one time. So they migrated meander to family pods. Mm -hmm. And they probably didn't breed within that family pod. No, they didn't. They crossbred somehow. Mm -hmm. You're all crossbred inbred. Now, I don't know if you do it at the same time. Or you do all the crossbreeding and then you start inbreeding and then you crossbred and then you inbreed. I'm not sure. Because I can find you inbred. Especially the way you... Feature and genetic and the way you speak the languages and carry on and your traditions, that's inbreeding. <laughs> Tradition is inbreeding. And it's a mess. Oh, you're a, just a pathetic mess of it. You are. So we use the word native. Native. What do they call themselves in the Middle East? I mean, that must be another word. Tribal! And you don't know the core of it. It certainly isn't to a piece of land. That's our property. That's caused all the fighting. We didn't have enough game to share. Well, Europe sure proved that's baloney. You had enough game to share. You never needed to invite Europe here to cut any wood either. Wood. Would I? Hook nose, hook nose. It's going. Ah, ah. Gotta get going now. I gotta go. Just bundle up and nice things. You can do it. Bundle up. Your sour attitude's cold. Bundle up. Treat each other super nice. The one that, the most sour, the most. Find the most sour and flood him. Find that kid that shot that police over Rainier. Flood him with kindness. Before he dies.
Well, he's already dead. You killed him a long time ago. Long before he killed that police officer, you killed that boy. We need a walking corpse. Killed a police officer in Rainier, Oregon. <laughs> walking corpse! Look, he's looking like a zombie! He was killed years ago as a child. That's obvious. Everybody can't see that's an idiot. That boy's a zombie. Flooding was sweet. He's a zombie. And I'll tell you what, the police department in Rainier, Oregon is priceless. The wit, the staff, the police department in Rainier, Oregon. Man, I wish they were my crew. I do. I just wish for a crew like that. I talked to a lady there, the man, I'll just bow to that always in my life. That's what my dad taught me to respect, and I do. A lot. Mm -hmm. Adam, I recognize you, and my pop taught me to respect that. Thank you very much, madam.